Well, we started by trying to build a, a brick and slate, did we not? Yep, we did. And my son-in-law, bless him, finally said, uh, what, would you like one of these? Would you have one of these? And I said, certainly. I think they're wonderful. We did, didn't we? We did look at other companies, yes. but I always have a, a very a very good package and the way they can you know, work through the planning authority and they can uh, design more or less whatever annex you want. And they were experts in the field. Well, I've, several of my friends have been and said how much they, they really like it and they wish they'd got one. Uh, and uh, it's a matter of finding the place to put it. Well, you've done a lot of gardening. I've done a lot of gardening, yes, that's true. Gardening, knitting, jigsaws? I knit. I do jigsaws a lot, yes. On the Getting table. out and about? Well, it may have moved, but it was on the... I always have one on the table, a big one, a thousand piece. Help you to look after a great-grandson. So. I look after Rowan occasionally. And um, I also do code words and crosswords and, and uh, the occasional housework. <laughs> well, you have to admit, when you're getting older, that you can't do as much as you used to do. And it's, uh, it's always the feeling that sort of, will I fall and lie there and nobody will know? I mean, as I say, I have a lot of friends, but they aren't always dropping in. <laughs> and uh, I think Polly would notice if I didn't appear for 24 oh, hours, sure, wouldn't I think having the annex built has actually benefited the property. It's made it a much nicer place to be. And I know my mum's here, which is nice. Um, I just wish we could move the whole family in. I think that was one of the main selling points for IHOS was the fact that they, they were very confident that they could get through planning, no problems at all. And we were a bit battered, I suppose, by the planning process at that point, having tried to do a self-build. And honestly, IHOS was so confident and they've they been fantastic from the planning point of view, all the way through to uh, get a very successful conclusion. Well, there's something to point out really to anybody thinking about an IHOOS annex is because they've got these very standard designs in the catalogue and on the website. Um, but they actually flipped this whole thing, 180, for us because we wanted it the other way around. And that wasn't an issue, they could just do that for us. So instead of the living room being behind the tree, the kitchen's behind the tree and the living room's out here with the open aspect. And that, that was no issue at all. So that is something to really bear in mind, that they were very flexible. You can move it yeah. around, you know, don't we moved, just... we moved a cupboard, we moved some of the doors. Yes. We went to see one already built, close by, and uh, we were very impressed with the build quality. And we actually sort of, quietly when the owner wasn't looking, we sort of jumped up and down on the floor. And <laughs> nothing sure moved, which is fantastic, because if you do that yeah. in a park home, everything sort of rattles slightly. Rattles. Oh, no, this, is, this is absolutely yeah. rock solid, it's a proper house. I would certainly recommend them. I have done already uh, <clears throat> to my, you know, people who've been, and uh, also to one or two people I've spoken to, uh, and uh, I, I would rate them very highly. Definitely, yes, definitely. I am very content. That's what I want to be.